Capricorn. Hi, welcome. This is your mid-October tarot reading. Um, how are you doing? I hope you're okay. Um, so it's if you've got Capricorn anywhere in your chart, you may resonate. And um, we're going to look into the energy for you for mid-October. Thanks for subscribing. Thanks for giving the video a thumbs up as well. So, uh, Spirit, please show us a message. What's happening for the um, Capricorn? mid-October okay Capricorn mid-October please hmm. follow your heart a love of home and family a trustworthy psychic information um this is the Queen of Cups energy Okay, so you're going to be much more in tune with how you nurture yourself in mid-October. Um, and um, I'll just show you the energy. It's a very spiritual energy. You're very spiritually in tune. You're very much in tune with your needs. This is about you. It's like you've unblocked something. You've unlocked something in yourself. Um, and you start to flow so much more with the people around you. Um, also, you know, getting more psychic information comes through. So let's see what fairy energy you're getting. Huh. Fairy godmother, amazing. There's something very, very nurturing going on here. Something has been unblocked. I feel there's been a period of time and it could be quite a prolonged period of time where you've sort of um, been neglected, um, probably by people around you. Um, but it's a mirror that you were sort of neglecting yourself and you weren't really, you were a bit, you know, disconnected. Now, with these energies, there is a whole lot of nurturing energy going on in mid-October right now your energy is really softening it's really softening and when I mean that I'm not saying you're going to be soft towards other people but it's just it's like there's a gentle energy because you're there's no barriers to your own self there's more self-love it's like it's easier for you to prioritize yourself um, and of course, when we do that, we start to attract people that prioritise us, you know. Uh, let's see, go a bit deeper for Capricorn. Justice, Four of Pentacles, Nine of Swords. So, you've balanced some karma here. There was some karma that needed to be cleared. And that is probably what this coldness has been about, this neglect, this feeling that you've been somehow, I just get, keep getting neglected, you know, your needs not being noticed by others or, you know, you miss, you've been missing out. But Tarot is showing that very recently, you know, or like as we end September, some karma has been balanced. You've paid off karmic debt through... The challenges you've been going through basically most likely um and you're moving into a period of time where you're much more careful you're much more careful about what you're doing you're much more careful about what you're thinking you're much more careful about your energy and it's really really going to pay off massively uh money's going to improve for you opportunities are going to improve for you and you're going to be receiving a lot more love and attention um, it's because you've paid off some karma and it's like all of a sudden, boom, you know. Now, uh, when you're being more careful and more cautious here, um, as you move forward, it's just naturally going to happen because <laughs> that's the level of consciousness you're now at. It's not something you have to plan or remember me saying. It's what will happen because you're at a level of consciousness that this is how you're now operating. 
and you're more conscious about how you're going about things. So you're going to just naturally find um, yourself receiving more love, like I said, more attention and more money, you know, uh, from mid-October mid onwards, even maybe slightly before that. Um, and um, it's good news. Very, this is very good news. Things starting to move more in your favour. Um, now, you actually, your ego, which, by the way, is obviously a complete, it's the false self, it's a separate entity from you, it's not who you are. Uh, the, the ego, uh, which is the mind, may try to get panicked. <laughs> you know, you may be worried, uh, thinking, you know, God, am I doing the right things? What the hell am I doing? Um, it's, it's confusing. Um, but it's just the ego messing with you. And it's really important not to listen to that voice because it's wrong. <laughs> it's just totally wrong. Uh, it's just spooking you for no reason because uh, you're at a totally different point in time now. A totally different vibration, okay? So things are actually going to keep improving for you now. Now, you're connected to somebody that's that, that senses a loss, okay? They feel... Um, I think this person's been grieving or very sad. They feel like they've lost something or they feel like they lost someone. But actually, um, you know, there's actually something very good in store for this person that they cannot, they have not been able to recognise or see. somebody here saying I have a lot of sexual thoughts about you <laughs> oh dear. you've got an admirer you've definitely got an admirer there um okay let's see what your spirit guides are saying longing for home belonging the original light workers <laughs> Yeah, your spirit guides are bringing you back. They're bringing you back to yourself. Um, it's like you got lost for a while and you sort of didn't know who you were or something. You went off path, but they're bringing you back. And, and mid-October is a really pivotal time for Capricorn where you suddenly, it's like, wow, <laughs> here I am again. I remember who I am. After all this time, I remember who I am. And where you make that connection, that's what I'm saying, once you make the connection inside yourself, because everything's connected in the universe, that's when everything starts to go right, you see. So you're worrying over nothing there. Just ignore those thoughts because the, all the connections are happening. And it's going to happen for your person too. This person you know who's sad, grieving or something, um, they've been lost as well. But uh, again, they're going to be making connections. They don't realise. They're just right around the corner from making a huge connection. And once they make that connection inside their head, um, well, it's not really inside the head, but you know what I mean, it, boom, it will all start to improve for them as well. So I'm really pleased for you. That's the message. Thanks for subscribing. Thanks for giving the video a thumbs up. If you do want to book in, just contact me. I'm doing a like more affordable reading. If you're interested in having that, just contact me as well. Peace.